the super fine hairspray. I'm obsessed with this. I'm not a person that uses hairspray a ton. Sometimes I don't use it, but um, if I'm going out or if it's very humid out, I like to spray my hair a little bit. I've used that before. It works very well. <laughs> yeah, this one really works very, very well. Um, I used to use the bedhead one, but it's just so heavy and it would make my hair so hard. I truly saw the difference when I started using this. It's a fine mist. Um, so the particles are super small, which is nice. Also, it smells so good. Again, it's not like... This isn't like a super feminine smell. Like if you were a guy, you can definitely use this and it's not going to smell like florally or too feminine. Um, it just, it actually smells very, very nice. And I like this for spraying my curls just to get the frizz away and to hold, even though it's very fine. And the hold, I think, is a four out of 10 for their hairsprays. It's still very, very effective. Um... It, it works better and I don't understand how this works, but it works better than the bed head one that made my hair so hard. Um, I, I sometimes wear my hair like slicked back and I like to slick it back with hairspray. I used this to do that and I could not believe how well my hair stayed back. Um, I have some shorter pieces like in the front here that tend to fall out sometimes. And I, I sprayed this, brushed it back into the bun, and I didn't even need bobby pins over here to keep them in. They stayed in the whole entire day, which is awesome. Um, so even though this is fine and doesn't make your hair like hard, it's, it's powerful and it works very, very well and does not weigh down your hair and make it crunchy and hard and actually gives your hair a little bit of shine too. So this is amazing. The bottle's big. like. There's a good amount of product in here, and I think you get a good amount for your money. Aribe is definitely more of an expensive hairline, but I think investing in good products for your hair is worth it. I feel like it's just like skincare. You need to invest in good products. They don't always have to be expensive. Not all of them have to be expensive. You can get good ones that aren't as expensive, but some of them you do want to invest, and I think this is a good product to invest in that I... I'm officially swapping out for my other brand I was using. Um, so this one's very good. Then I religiously use dry shampoo and I will not use one that's crappy. Like I just refuse. I hate the ones that make your hair feel like chalky and gross and make your head all white. It's not fun. It's not fun at all. Um, this is the Aribe Dry Texturizing Spray. So it's a dry shampoo and a texturizing spray. So you can spray this into your roots. It doesn't leave any white residue. You'll spray it. Um, again, this one smells so good. I feel like it smells very similar, if not the same, to the hairspray. I like this because dry shampoo, then it gives your hair like a little grit and texture. So it'll when I curl my hair and use this, it gives me that like messy, like lived in beachy wave kind of look, which I always am trying to go for. And it's not easy all the time with my type of hair. Um, Cause it can just, my hair can be very smooth and not have enough texture to it. So this definitely helps with that. Also, I love using this on my hair before I style it um, the day I wash it. Because when you wash your hair, you're stripping everything off and it will not like hold styles as well. So I spray this on after I blow dry, but before I curl it so that my curls hold, have something to like grip onto and stay. Um, so I love this a lot. And then you get the 15% off, which is great. Um, I know Ruby is a little expensive. I've never tried it before until the live stream. Um, but I'm happy that I went for it and got these because I was missing out. I was truly missing out. These are really, really good products that I recommend. And now I use them like every day. Um, let me share that on the screen too. 